Here. This message is directed at the terrorist attacking and taking over Royal... Willie Gold is back in the area. The Royal Army is trying to retake this outpost. We need immediate assistance. Responsible to justice, no matter the cost. Oh, so the rumors are true. Come in, come in, come in. I don't know whether to call you Ajay or Adonis. Those brooding eyes, that determined jaw. Your clothes are more Salvation Army than Golden Path. But I can work with this. <laughs> Who are you? I am Mumu Chiffon, tailor to the crown by the appointment of King of Kriat, His Royal Highness, Pagan Men. But you may call me Mr. Chiffon. It's a pleasure to meet you. You work for men. I used to. The king and I had a falling out. 
He tried to kill me and now I'm in hiding. But that's ancient history. Let's talk about the future. Kriyat Fashion Week is coming up and I believe we can help each other out. You need accessories and I need a model. I would like to make you the centerpiece of my new collection. I call it Combat Couture. And you want me to wear this stuff? These? <laughs> These are just experiments. No, only the finest raiments for the prodigal son. I spent years studying rational garment design at the top Parisian academy. A garment must be useful before it's elegant. Form must follow function. Arms up. I will send you to gather exotic materials. Furs, skins, feathers. To accentuate your role in primal attributes. I shall send you the design and locations. I hope you are as good with the sewing machine as you are with the machine gun. Because together, you're going to make you look fierce. Well, don't, don't just stand there. Time flies. Return when you have finished crafting my creations. Just missed the action. Have we met? Man, I'm the cavalry, man. I was gonna roll up here like goddamn Clint Eastwood. I'm Herc. I heard about you, man. Taking names and writing checks out to kick it ass, man. That's why I'm here. Because you and me together, Golden Path won't know what hit them right in their faces. We are the Golden Path. Man, I do not understand what you are saying. I don't speak your language. I think what you meant to say is that uh, the Royal Army won't know what hit him. You see, we're, we're the Golden Path. Dude, seriously? These guys have been giving me a lot of stank eye over the things I've been saying about the Golden Path, so that makes sense. Okay, new plan then. Preemptive cavalry, that's right. You need help, you call, we swoop in and help you, me or my, uh, uh, Golden Path. Golden Path, buddies. That's right. You and me, man. New and improved tat bros. That's right. Living the dream. Come on. Punch it in. Boom. I wear french fries. You stay potato. That's all right. You kind of came in on the slow bus, too, but you got there, so I got respect for that. I'm going to see you around, though, okay? Okay. Let's roll, Golden Path, homie. Woo! Okay, then.
Ajay Gale, the man with the golden name. Who is this? Ajay, I'm hurt. <laughs> you don't recognize my voice? Should I? The voice of Radio Freaky Rat? This is Rabbi Ray Rana. You don't, you don't recognize that? Right, Robbie Ray Rana. Just call me Rabbi Ray, man. Okay, Robbie Ray. What's this about? Look, we need a face-to-face. -face. I'm sending you my coordinates. Come find me, man. It's a ball. Was that intel from the camp worth it? Did you even read it? Because I've got some intelligence for you. And it's solid. Nine of my men are dead. Good men you let die. You guys put me in a difficult position. The right choice was obvious! It's what your father would have done. That's the golden path! That's the direction we were going before he died and it all went to shit! Amita doesn't get it. She's always put her goals first. She's underhanded, she's subversive, and she always sacrifices lives. That's why I stepped up. I stepped up because I knew your father. And I respected his vision. You need to learn what drove him. What drives us. Go to the monastery. Educate yourself, Ajay. on my favorite nephew. So tell me, Alje, who are you rooting for so far? Have you fallen into Amitar's honey pups, or have you been dazzled by Saval's blowing locks and bad boy jar line? Hey, each to his own. That's your lifestyle choice to make. It isn't my cup of tea, contrary to the rash assumptions some may make about my appearance. I am indeed batting for the other team. You more than most should know that there was only ever one woman for me, my boy. 